Hey, how's it going? Today we're gonna go over how to draw a butterfly. It's gonna be really simple, really easy. This is probably the easiest one you're gonna do in a while. So get paper, get marker, any kind of marker, it doesn't matter. Also, you can also use a pencil. It doesn't really matter what you use, but if you want suggestions, I'm gonna put those links in the description so you can go check those out. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Let's get started. Beginners, step by step. So follow along with me, that's really important. All right, first thing I do, is I am going to draw the middle of the butterfly. It's just gonna be kind of a wiggly shape, almost like a weird stain in the paper. Don't worry. Real simple, right? Okay. Then I'm gonna pull out a thin line for the antenna. Pull two. might pull for style, separate the top two there. Okay, we're good. Then I'm gonna throw a pretty long curve on the left side first because I'm right-handed. I guess you can do the other side if, if you're um, left-handed. But uh, I would say pull up, slight bend. I have that kind of curve. That's gonna be obviously the top of one of the wings. Alrighty, we good? Also, uh, don't be afraid to pause, rewind anything you need to, don't worry about it. Also, uh, give me some suggestions of other stuff you wanna see me draw. Definitely comment to me. If anything else, just say hi to me in the comments. I, I love it, I love it. It really makes me feel like you guys are watching. It, it gives me more motivated to do more. All right, I'm gonna pull down. And then put another slight bend there. Just a little bit of a bend, right? So we have a line like that now. Curving down inward. Okay. Pulling around shape. Small bubble shape here. Kind of give it some texture, kind of give it some character. Another small shape here. And I'm gonna pull a large kind of lump at the bottom. Another lump. And I'm gonna connect that into the actual butterfly. Okay. Uh, next thing I'm gonna do is I could well, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start with this side and I'm gonna finish this left side before I go on to the right. So I'm gonna put the design into it. So you can make up any design you want, by the way. At this point, you have the shape. You can kind of just do whatever you want on the inside. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw a long line here. Slight bend. Pulling in. Okay. Another shape like that. Another one. I'm gonna do one more, okay? Bam, one more. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna find uh, maybe like four or five circles here because I'm gonna fill this shape in entirely, by the way. So I'm gonna find a circle here. I'm gonna go all the way up. I'm gonna do four. I mean, you can do whatever you want. You can do maybe three or four, however long it, it, it allows for. And see, now I have those shapes there. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill this in. That's why I kind of use them with marker. Marker's a lot easier to do this. You can also do it in colored pencil, by the way. You know, just kind of like afterward, after you're done with the line art, you can always do it in colored pencil. Alrighty. Now I got that. See how it looks so much better? Right there, just kind of filled in as a dark shape. Then I'm gonna go over here. And I'm gonna kinda of do the exact same shape, but uh, kind of for the most part, not really. I'm gonna cut that one out right here. So you want that just repeating pattern, this outside. And also I'm gonna fill this in right now. You want this repeating 
pattern going on. Okay. Good. Let's move on to the other side. So now you know what's on the other side. But the other side, we're gonna make it thinner. We're not gonna make it. You could make the exact same shape over here. Totally fine. But I'm gonna I'm gonna do a little bit differently. I'm gonna pull up. Not as as much of a bend. Pull down. Pull down here and then wrap in. So it's gonna be a little bit smaller, like it's at a slight perspective. And I'm gonna do the same shape here a bit, not as far. Small shapes here, down here as well. And I'm gonna pull up to there. Okay. And for me, I'm just gonna take care of the bottom part first because I think the bottom is easier. I'm gonna pull another kind of repeated shape down here. And then I'm going to try to duplicate this exact shape on this side. I'm gonna do Same thing, just try to find the same shapes. Actually, that should be down here more. Let me pull this down here. And then I'll probably, I'll take out one of these. Okay, so that's the way I'm gonna do it. Now I'm gonna fill it in. I'm gonna need another one of these soon. This thing's getting dry. And that is it. That is the entire thing. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed that. Hopefully you came up with like a cute butterfly of your own. Um, please do me a huge favor, hit that like button, like I said, and also definitely share it like I was talking about. Sharing it is a big part of this channel because I feel like people are actually watching me. Uh, otherwise, I'm not really motivated to do anything if I feel nobody's watching, but everybody's been super, super nice to me on this channel and I'm very grateful you picked. If you're watching it at this point, I mean, that's amazing. You watched the whole thing. Um, I'm very grateful that uh, you're here and I wanna thank you and uh, I'll see you very soon.